Hi guys, my name is Kas and you are watching my Reckless Couch Potato channel. English is not my native language, but I hope you will understand me. Eight months ago, I started to lose weight and I managed to lose about 20 kilograms in eight months. Wow! That's how I looked a year ago. <laughs> and this is me now. In this video, I want to show you how I make at home a very simple but very healthy product. It's called Apple Chips. These are these wonderful chips. My chips are very crunchy. See? See how crispy they are. You can see the sound of crispiness. I managed to make them so crispy because I dehydrate apples for 10 to 12 hours and they practically do not have any moisture inside. And it turned out that people like apple chips when they are very dry. So if you want to make apple chips and make them really tasty, Try to dehydrate apples for more than 10 hours. I got it! So, how do I make them? It's very easy and I will show you now. To make excellent apple chips, you need fresh apples, apple slicer. This is the ready product I want to show you. See how crispy it is. You need a dehydrator and you need a big package with zipper. You need zipper because zipper helps you to preserve ready product from moisture. I want to say a couple of words about this apple slicer. Apple slicer is very important device in production of homemade apple chips. And I advise you to find a good quality apple slicer. I'm taking right now the apple slicer produced by New Zealand company called Hydroflow. This company has a trademark called Ezidri. I found it occasionally on my market and it's really astonishing that I'm using the product designed and produced 10,000 kilometers from me in New Zealand. But it's a great product, believe me. It's very heavy, it's very sturdy, and I'm using it for two years already, and it has no damages at all on it. So I strongly recommend this Hydroflow product to you, and if you find it on your market, buy it without any hesitation. Wow! A couple of words about dehydrator. Uh, I'm using a pretty cheap dehydrator. I paid for it maybe $50, but it's working amazingly good. It consumes only 500 watts of uh, electric energy, uh, so it's pretty efficient and um, I'm totally satisfied with its quality. It's easily to clean. It's made of very sturdy plastic and I'm um, very satisfied with this product. I got it! So, I washed my apples and now I'm showing you how this apple slicer works. It's working very, very easy. Oh. So, I cut the skin, clean it a little bit. My apple is ready. So I just finished to cut and slice 
my apples. All five trays are full. I put it then like this, cover and switch it on, put maximum temperature and leave it for approximately 10 to 12 hours. Hi guys, this is Kas again. So 12 hours have gone and my beautiful crispy apple chips are ready. Now I will let them cool down for a while, approximately 15 to 20 minutes. I'm packaging it only after they cool down. Because if I do it when they are hot, the moisture start, starts vaporizing inside of the bag and they will lose their wonderful crispiness. I got it! Do you hear it? Up. Up. Yeah, that's what I like the most, this sound. Nice, really nice crispy apple chips. Wow! So, that's all for today, guys. My beautiful, healthy and very sweet apple chips are ready. Thank you for watching this video on my Reckless Couch Potato channel. Love yourself, learn yourself, change yourself, because anyone can be a hero, even a couch potato like me. Goodbye, guys.